Hello people, Lars Lehmann once again for Warwick, Germany. I have here in my hands a beautiful Warwick Corvette Double Buck from the Pro Series. This one is from the Limited Edition uh, 2023. Let's check it out. First up we have this beautiful body top made of marbled ebony. Very beautiful wood on the back of the instrument. You can see uh, it's a swampish body with a nice transparent satin finish. So bolt on construction we have a five piece neck consisting of a maple as well as ikanga stripes. Now the fretboard is made from tiger stripe ebony and carries 24 beautiful uh, jumbo brass frets. Extra hard. You will not find the typical T-shape fret ends, right? Because they have what they call the IFT, the invisible fret technology. So there's no sharp fret ends sticking out of the fingerboard. It just feels amazing. Check this out, guys. There's two nice little features here. First, we have this nice little bass clef here. Okay. And also we have these beautiful glow-in-the-dark side dots. Perfect for dark stages. Now, tuner-wise, we have four Warwick machine heads, closed tuners. Okay. We have a Warwick just in a three. Perfect for uh, adjusting the string height in the lower registers. And on the other end of the bass, we have the world famous two piece Warwick bridge, two MEC humbuckers, and we have an MEC preamp consisting of volume, balance, treble, bass, and we have two three way toggle switches for the humbuckers for single coil, parallel, and series mode. Now on the back of the base, you can see it's actually a traditional bolt-on construction, right, for screws. We have a quick access electronics compartment cover, which makes changing your battery very, very easy. Now while these instruments might not be the lightest instruments on earth, they are extremely well balanced. Check this out. No neck dive. Very well balanced. Okay, are you as curious as I am how this thing sounds like? I'm gonna play the four string first and you'll get to hear the five string a little later on. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna be using the uh, Warwick Gnome mini bass hat along with a Warwick Gnome two by 10 cap. Now the tonal possibilities are uh, close to endless really with this instrument. I'm gonna start out in passive mode by pulling my volume knob, okay. Um, I have the back pickup on, and I'm gonna start out by showing you what each pickup can do, okay. So, passive mode, uh, back pickup all the way. This is single coil. Here's parallel. And here is series. Now the same for the front pickup. Front pickup all the way. Here is single coil. Here's parallel. Last but not least, series mode. Okay, and now you can start combining both pickups, both pickups on, and let's say uh, I have the back pickup in parallel mode, and front pickup in series mode, how's that? 
Well, series and series. And so on and so on. The possibilities are really endless. Okay, so far I haven't even touched the EQ, okay? So I am now in active mode. Uh, what am I gonna do? Okay, here is the back pickup in parallel mode and I have a slight boost of travel and bass. Here's the same setting with the back pickup in series mode. Buckle up. Okay, here's the front pickup. I have tamed the treble a little bit and there's a slight bass boost and the front pickup is in parallel mode. And here's the same setting in series mode. Okay, here's both pickups in parallel mode with a slight treble and bass boost. Okay, I now have the five string bass with me. And first and foremost, of course, you all wanna know how the B string sounds, okay? So here it is, both pickups on in parallel mode with a slight boost of bass and treble. <laughs> Okay, same setting, but played with a plectrum. This is some sort of rock metal-ish kind of riff. Awesome basses, huh? This is the Warwick Corvette Double Buck Pro Series Limited Edition 2023. You definitely want to try to check out these amazing instruments, okay? Uh, if you liked what you saw and heard, please hit the like and subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications on new videos. If you want to get more information on Warwick Basses, please check out warwickbass.com. That's it from me for today. I'm Lars, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you.